So what are varicose veins? Varicose veins are abnormally dilated veins underneath the skin as opposed to thread veins, which are these fine blue purpley veins that you see within the skin. Um, why do people get them? Um, essentially, in a nutshell, it's because the valves within the veins fail. Okay. But there are certain risk factors that predispose you to getting varicose veins, and those are things like family history, um, if you have uh, multiple pregnancies, um, there are hormonal associations um, and uh, previous deep venous thrombosis. Um, once people have them, what can people do to prevent them getting worse? Essentially, there's very little. I mean, there's no kind of cream or tablet that you can take to reverse the varicose veins because it is a mechanical problem. What you can use is a compression stocking um, and also try to walk as much as you can. Um, when should people consider surgery? Essentially, if you're getting symptoms which are troubling you, which the stocking is not helping you with. Um, and if you're getting skin changes, so things like brown pigmentation to the skin, hardening of the skin, drying of the skin, and the worst scenario is an ulcer, which is what we want to prevent. But also things like bleeding of the varicose vein or phlebitis of the varicose vein. Um, what are the different types of surgery? Um, there's conventional open surgery, which people will recognise as stripping, but we now have new treatments which are endovenous or keyhole techniques where we treat the vein from within rather than removing the vein from the body. And we do this using things like laser, radio frequency or foam. What are the, what are the benefits of the new techniques? Well, in a nutshell, as with all minimal invasive techniques, it's the fact that you have smaller scars, less pain and, and quicker recovery. Um, before surgery, what can people do to help themselves? Um, essentially, they can walk as much as they can um, and use a stocking compliantly. Um, some women tend to get varicose veins in pregnancy. Uh, do these tend to carry on after the pregnancy is finished? The reason why they get them during pregnancy is because of the hormonal changes and also the physical presence of, uh, of the enlarged womb. Um, and obviously those reverse after delivery, so some of the varicose veins should disappear, but maybe not all.